Stay tuned for the latest message excerpt from josephprince.com. Hasid wisdom is actually grace wisdom. Amen? Grace wisdom. Wisdom in Hebrew, there are a number of words. The number one word for wisdom in, in Hebrew is chokmah. Chokmah, from where you get words like hakam. You know, when they say it's a judge in Hebrew, let's say a person is a judge, you will say he's a hakam. The word for a judge is hakam. All right? So you hakam. Uh, you're a judge. You make wise decisions. Hokma is the general word. Hokma is in the Greek, Sophia. Now in Hebrew, wisdom, the most frequently used word for wisdom is hokma. And in the Greek, what is what? What translates uh, Hokma in the Greek would be Sophia. So if your name is Sophia, that means your name is wisdom. Amen. The Bible says when you embrace wisdom, wisdom is personified as a woman. When you embrace wisdom, you get five things. Number one, in her right hand, come on people, you all know this by now, is length of days. That is your health. Amen. In her right hand. Right hand is always a priority hand in the scriptures. Amen. In her left hand, you have riches and honor. So these are the things that everyone pursues in life. You know, they're they not actually looking for a certain job. They're not actually looking for that investment to pay off. They're not actually looking for a, 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 what they call it, lucky strike, you know, in their lottery or whatever. They're actually looking for these things that life can give. They believe that those things can give them these five things. So the Bible says, uh, and all her paths are pleasantness or pleasure, right? And, and all her ways are pleasantness and all her paths are shalom, peace. So wisdom gives you five things. Let's say it. Length of days, riches, honor, pleasure, peace. So the Bible says when you embrace her, notice when you embrace someone, her two hands are behind you. Amen? So you don't look for those hands. The Bible says, turn not to the right hand, nor to the left. Pursue the Lord, and these things will pursue you. Amen. Amen? Now, is it possible that the people of the world have wisdom? Yes. Like I said just now, judges and people in these kind of positions, they are called hakam. All right, how hakim. And these are, are people who make wise decisions. They are people with natural wisdom. God, God makes His reign to fall on the just and the unjust. There is a verse that says, every good, say good, Every perfect, say perfect, gift is from above, from the Father of lights with whom there is no variableness, neither shadow of turning, not even a shadow of turning. Amen. So notice, good gifts are gifts for everybody, whether they are believers or not, whether they are the household of the Father or not, it is for all of them. Like medicine, I believe is a good gift from God, the good ones. Amen. A lot of inventions that, that help our life become simpler and uh, uh, more convenient. So any, anything good out there in the world, amen? Shall we put Facebook there? So these are all good. It's for everybody. But perfect are the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Every perfect, every good gift is for everyone, and, but every perfect gift is only for His children. Amen. Can I have a good amen? amen? The Bible says the way you get wisdom is any, if any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God. So there's no problem that you're faced with today that God does not have a, prob, a, a solution to or an answer in His wisdom. Amen. If we will, but just ask. If any of you lack wisdom, look at this uh, verse here, James chapter 1. If any of you lacks wisdom, and you know, when you read this, if you are a wise man, a wise woman, you will always say, I lack wisdom. I, I, I don't seem to get to the, to the root of the matter. I don't seem to get it. You know, so if any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God. When I read this verse, I always see my need for this verse. Amen? I, I look at this church and I, 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 I always feel like, I, oh Lord, I, I'm so desperate for that wisdom. I know you have that wisdom for your people. Uh, when you are faced with a, uh, what seems to be an insurmountable odds against you, there is a wisdom for it. Amen? Every challenge occurs so that you can... Find that key from the, from, from the Lord and see if that key fits the lock. Amen. This excerpt is brought to you by josephprince.com. 
To get the full message, visit josephprince.com.